what's up what's going on welcome to my channel we're going to be setting up the nintendo ds emulator within aurora on your modded xbox 360 let's get underway first off press the back button on your controller go to scripts go down to homebrew store then emulators scroll down till you get to dsun 360 press a on it and select yes to download you'll get a notification saying it's installed press the b button several times and you want to refresh it select yes Give it a second to compile and find it and obviously it needs to download its box art. You're going to need a USB device, insert it into your Xbox 360 and press the guide button. You want to scroll over twice to the right hand side and go down to system settings, select yes. Go to storage, we're going to format it. You want to scroll all the way down to the bottom USB storage device if it says unformatted go through the motions of formatting it remove it from your Xbox 360 and insert it into your PC create a new folder and call it ROMs and you need to dump your Nintendo DS ROMs in there. They have to be extracted from zip. They can't be in zip format. They have to be in NDS format or dot NDS format. Otherwise the emulator will crash. Eject your USB device from your PC and reinsert it back into your Xbox 360. Get a notification saying that it's inserted and press the back button go to file manager go all the way down to usb 0 select the roms folder press left on the controller go down to copy press a press rb go down to hdd1 all the way down to emulators go into the dsun folder and you can see there's a roms folder there already press left on the controller go to paste and press a as we're going to overwrite it complete press B all the way back to the dashboard and we're going to launch the emulator give it a second to compile and then select your game and press A if you want to quit out of the game press in the right analog stick as a button and you'll come up with the menu unfortunately this emulator doesn't run too well I've tried many games um, yeah so I'm not quite I'm not liking this but you know at least it's up and running That's it for this video. If you've learned something today, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.